Welcome to the e-learning platform of BSIT's Mechanical Engineering Department. I am Viren Biridi and we are studying Manufacturing Processes having subject code 22446. Today we will start with unit number 4, Forming Processes that has 16 marks weightage in our syllabus. The learning outcomes of this particular video are at the end of this video you will be able to select relevant forming process for the given component with justification. So let's get started. Forging. Now forging is the process of shaping heated metal by the application of sudden blows like hammer forging or steady pressure that is in the case of press forging and makes use of the characteristics of plasticity of the material. Forging made upon material heat karto, garam karto, and garam zaranantar either upon tela eka hammer ni maranar blow karanar manje zor zora techa varti gana gati ah uh, karanar maranar techa varti kiwa. Steady pressure apply करना press जैसा है यानी steady pressure तेजावर्ती apply करना and in that we will make the use of characteristic that is plasticity of that material. Forging is metal forming process which may be done by hand or by machine. अपन हाथोड़ा जो आए तो हाथानी पर मारु शक्तो कि वहाँ press है machine operate पर करु शक्तो. In case of hand forging, hammering is done by hand, whereas forging by machine involves the use of dies and it is mostly used in mass production. So this is the figure. Okay, so here we have this anvil, aniha lower die hai, ani echavarti hot material thevlila hai jala billet asamanta. आणि मग त्याच्यावरती वरचा जो डाय आहे त्या वरचा डाय या रॅमच्या सहाय्याने आपण तो जोरात त्याच्यावरती आपटतो आणि त्याला त्याची प्लास्टिसिटी ही कॅरेक्टरिस्टिक वापरून त्याला वेगळ्या शेप मध्ये रूपांतरित करतो सो हियर वी कॅन सी की इथे तो वर्ण जेव्हा तो रॅम जोरात खाली आलेला आहे तेव्हा त्याचा शेप चेंज झालेला आहे So whatever may be the method of applying pressure for shaping the metal, the primary requirement is to heat the metal to a definite temperature to bring it into the plastic state. Apan kutlya hi paddhati ni techawarthi pressure apply karna rasu manja hata ni hathode ni marana rasu ki huwa press ni tela gradually techawarthi pressure dena rasu. Sagat mahato chi ghosht ka ya hai ki tiyam metal la एक डेफिनेट टेम्परेचर पर्यत गरम कराएं सो दैट इट विल बिकम प्लास्टिक इन नेचर मजे अपने शेप देता दिस मे बी डन इन एन ओपन हर्थ कॉल्ड ऐज स्मिथ्स फोर्ज फॉर स्मॉल जॉब्स और इन क्लोज फर्नेसेस फॉर लार्ज जॉब्स द शॉप इन विच द वर्क इज कैरिड आउट इज कॉल्ड ऐज स्मिथी और स्मिथ्स शॉप फोर्जिंग कुटल्या हेचा मदे केल जात, शॉप मदे केल जात, तर त्याला स्मीथी अस मंटा, जस की मशिनिंग मशिन शॉप मदे केल जात, कास्टिंग हे फोर्जिंग मदे केल जात, सॉरी, कास्टिंग हे फाउंडरी मदे केल जात, सिमिलरली फोर्जिंग हे स्मीथी मदे केल जात. The metals which are used in forging process must possess the required ductility. ductility आणि डक्टिलिटी ही प्रॉपर्टी असणं गरजेचं आहे वी नो दॅट डक्टिलिटी रिफर्स टू द कॅपॅसिटी ऑफ अ मटेरियल टू अंडरगो डिफॉर्मेशन अंडर टेन्शन विदाउट फेल्युअर दॅट इज द डेफिनेशन ऑफ द डक्टिलिटी द कॉमनली युज्ड फोर्जिंग मटेरियल्स आर ॲल्युमिनियम अलॉयज कॉपर अलॉयज लो कार्बन स्टील अलॉय स्टील निकेल अलॉय टंगस्टन अलॉय सो ऑन अँड सो फोर्थ Now what are the advantages of this process that is forging? 
in forging process grain flow is continuous and uninterrupted it gives greater strength and toughness to the forged components forged components madli जो टफनेस आणि स्ट्रेंथ आहे हा चांगला असतो इफ यू रिफर टू द फिगर दॅट इज इन द नेक्स्ट स्लाईड दॅट शोज थ्री स्पॅनर्स वन इज प्रोड्यूस्ड बाय कास्टिंग द अदर इज मशिनिंग अँड द थर्ड वन इज फोर्जिंग इफ वी सी द फर्स्ट वन इज कास्टेड वन द सेकंड इज मशिन्ड अँड द थर्ड वन इज फोर्ज्ड so the cast spanner is the weakest of all the machined spanner is relatively stronger and the strongest will be the forged spanner forged components require minimum surface finish tyancha varti surface finish sudha kami lagta the forging process gives the high dimensional accuracy and that is the reason the further machining is not so much required in case of forging forged components have better mechanical properties like strength toughness etc they have better resistance to shock and vibrations also welding of forged parts is easy to be done what are the disadvantages complicated shapes cannot be forged easily jar shapes component che complicated astil tar te forging karta yet nahi forging process is mostly suitable for large parts do spanners and all those also we can forge but generally jar mothe parts astil tar forging karna changla asta forging of brittle materials is difficult due to high cost of forging dies forging process is costly also and more noise and vibrations are produced during the process so these are the few disadvantages of forging process after advantages and disadvantages let us see what are the applications of forging so forging process is used in manufacturing the following components like car axles crank shafts connecting rods leaf springs crane hooks jet engine turbine dies then blades levers flanges propellers railway wheel discs tank bottoms aircraft and rocket parts bolts nuts washers gear planks etc etc so it has got a wide range of applications where we can use forging process to manufacture these parts so that is about the advantages disadvantages and applications of forging so we have revised about the forging process then the advantages disadvantages and the applications in the next video we will discuss ups, upset forging and press forging till then thank you for watching and take care